add the percussion. With the talking drums, with the omelets. Um, just very like important parts and elements of this song. Like the, the instrumental by itself is just a vibe. So Danfo in Nigeria is is a is like public transportation. It's like this big, you know, just it's just yellow bus. But Danfo drivers are crazy. Like drive reckless. It's just insane. Comparing how like when women take pictures and they're like, you know what I'm saying? They got the hips looking right, they got this and they got that. And dudes just lose their mind. I just kept seeing a bunch of great pictures with amazing angles and the right filter. And I was like, yo, this is, this is really driving us crazy. Like, downfall drivers. For Danfo, um, Ari, she does like Beyonce and just, she's, she's lit. She just did like St. John and stuff. But when I played her, um, Danfo that had like an Afro vibe and bounce to it, and she just started going in. I just pressed record. Like I didn't, I wasted no time. And that's how you know she's a, she's a true musician. Like music is music and yes, like, some people have like cultural, you know, like barriers. Like they don't, because they, they're not really exposed to like a, like the African bounce, they don't really know. But she heard it and just like, -tum -tum, -tum -tum. I was like, oh my, this girl is crazy. Oh. This girl is mad. So when she did that, I thought that was really, really tight. <laughs> I by myself I'm crazy, but I still keep on chasing. This high that we're on is amazing, but I don't want to leave you. That is just what bad relationships sound like. Like if we do this right, we're a hell of a team. Like nobody should try to play with us. That's suicide. Like I wrote it from a place where like it could be a platonic relationship, same thing, it could be romantic. It could be a relationship with drugs. It could be a relationship with substance, with um, social media, Instagram. It's just like loving you is dangerous. You got me feeling high. You got me feeling low. I know this is toxic, I know this is bad, but I'm still loving you. Loving you is dangerous. It's like, damn, I know this is dangerous and I know I shouldn't be in this relationship. Floating started with a voice note. I was driving and I was like, I feel like I'm flying. Yeah, like I took it to the studio and then I had this old keyboard with crazy sounds. I started messing with it. I found some like congos and bongos on it and a bunch of stuff. And for like some of the percussion, I went to the window. I grabbed like a drumstick, a talking drum stick, and I started scratching on the window to create that like hi at you know, type sound. As soon as I did that, I was like, oh yeah, this, this, this crazy, this is what we gonna do.
Floating was like maybe 85% done. We sent it to Van Jess. They sent back the verse quick, like so fast because they love the song. I was like, oh shoot, this is crazy. I just wanted to have fun with it. Just, just talk about what it feels like to enjoy somebody's company and not care about time. Floating.